Hey guys, I'm back and I got a really cool card trick to show you. So for this trick, I'm going to be using a deck of cards. Okay, and I'm going to ask my spectator to select a card. Okay, so select one. Okay, show it to the camera, don't show it to me. Okay, now just put it inside anywhere, but leave it sticking out because I want to show you something. Now when I do this trick, everybody thinks that the full deck is the same card. The full deck is the same card. So I want to show you that all the cards are different. There are no doubles or anything of your card in the deck. Alright, you see all the cards are different. Okay. Alright. So now I want you to just take the deck and give it a good shuffle. Shuffle up the deck. Okay, bring the bring the cards a bit down so the camera can see the shuffling. Yeah. Alright. So now the deck is well shuffled and you have shuffled the cards. So there's no way I can know where your card is inside this deck or what your card is. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this box over here and I'm just going to put the deck inside. Okay, I'm going to put the deck inside and then I'm just going to close the box up. Okay, now if you give me a hand, I'm going to put the, the box on top and put the other hand on top. Alright, great. Now we'll keep the hands down. Now you see, uh, have you ever heard of pickpocketers? If you haven't, uh, what they can do is they can actually go inside your pocket, take out your wallet, and just steal. That's what pickpocketers do. So I'm going to try and do the same thing with this deck of cards. Okay. I'm just going to, uh, they can, what they can actually do is also they can just go inside their pocket, steal, whether it's a hundred dollar note, fifty dollar note, whatever, and they'll take out the, uh, no, with the highest value. So that's what I'm going to do with this card. Watch. I'm going to go through the deck, open it, and see it. I'm going to take out your card. And look, the box is still sealed. I mean, the box is still closed. And there are no holes at all. And the spec and you shuffle up the card, so it makes it even more impossible. Yeah, so that is the trick, guys. And let's get on to the tutorial. Okay, guys, welcome to the tutorial of this trick. For this trick, You'll be needing a deck of cards, okay? And what you're gonna do is you're just gonna ask the spectator to select the card. So okay, they select this one, the three of spades, okay? Now what you're gonna do is you're just gonna ask them to just put their card anywhere in the deck, or leave it sticking out, because you want to show them something. Okay, so you just leave it sticking out, and you just find the deck out. So you just put the whole deck over, face up, so they can see their card sticking out. Now this is what you do when the deck when the deck is flipped over like that. This is what you're gonna do. Now the deck is obviously all the cards are different and all that. Okay, but what you're gonna be doing, you're showing the cards that all the cards are different because you are gonna when you're holding the deck, you are just gonna put a crimp in their cards. So what you do is you just you just like that you just crimp it. So you put a little bend in the card there when you are showing that the deck is all that all the cards in the deck are different. Okay, so when you're showing what you're doing at the back is you're just taking your thumb and you're putting a bend in the card. See? And then you ask so now there's a crease in the cards, okay, where their card is, because you just bent it. So that's that card right there. Okay, and then you ask the spectator to shuffle it up because you want to make sure that that card is locked. You can do this for every trick, just bend the card so that the rest of the cards are different, bend the card, and then um, you can just see where the card is. So what I did was when my spectator finished shuffling, I just went to that brick where the crimp was, right there. And then I just cut the cards and I control that card to the top of the deck. So that's what I did. Because you have to put a crimp in the card and just cut the crimp, just like that. You can do, use this for every trick, okay, that you want. If you want to control the card to the top, just crimp the card, go to that break, and then cut it. So that's, so for this trick, you have to use that. Because if you're shuffling the cards, obviously the spectator knows that you're going to bring it to the bottom, to the top, wherever you want to bring it, so that when you put it in the box, you know exactly where it is. Okay, so that's why you, they need to shuffle it, and then you just cut it to the top. Now what you do is you take the cards and place them inside the box. But when you're placing them inside the box, 
here's what you have to do. You just basically place it inside, the box is still open, and the top card is their card. So you're just going to take it out like that. Just take out the top card and then close it. You see their card is right there. And then close it. So you can just easily slide out that card from this hole over here. Okay, so let me show you again. When the when you put the cards inside, just basically move the top card right over here. Or you could even just bend the deck over here. Just bend it. And you can see that when you bend it, the top card just moves it over there. Right there. Okay, see? Boom. The top card just moves all the way over here. And this is their card. So just bend it. And then close the deck. And their card just is right over there. So you can just easily take out, this is their card, you can just easily slide it out. And then you can just take the, the box, put it in their pocket, wherever, whatever, and you say, you start talking about pickpocketers, they can go inside the pocket, they just steal their wallet, they can feel whether it's a hundred dollar note, fifty dollar note, they'll just take out the note with the highest value, just make the story up about pickpocketers, and what you do is you go inside their pocket, and this is what you're going to do. Okay, you're going to go inside that pocket and this is what you're going to do. You're just going to go to the bottom of the box and just basically pull out the card. So it's easier if it's in their hand, like, like that. So you can just go right over there and pull out that card, like that. So it's very easy. You can even do it like that, show that that's is sealed, one, two, three, and then show that it's sealed again, I and mean, that it's closed again. So that's basically what you want to do, but it's better if it's in their hands and in their pocket, whatever. Okay, so just basically pull it out like that. Okay, and yeah, so that is a trick, guys. And uh, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments below, and I'll be happy to answer. Yeah, so thank you for watching, and please rate, comment, 